All right, we're here to take a look at the uh, NET UX1000 uh, PRI gateway and uh, take a look at what comes in the box. You, you know, immediately when you open the box, you'll see a nice big card to help you configure the unit uh, step by step. There is also an included Ethernet cable, power cord, it looks like some warranty papers in there. And uh, it looks like some software licensing. If you have a survival branch, this unit happens to just be a PRI gateway. And also, I already put them on, but the 19 inch rack ears are, you mount them after you get the unit, which is not uncommon. Of course, the power cord, which is already plugged in, and you hear it running. Uh, taking a look at the unit is standard 19 inch 1U unit. Um, I'm not sure if it's considered a half depth, but it's not it's not full depth. It is um, there you see the measuring stick to get an idea. That's an eight inch ruler. All right, just taking a look here. Um, have the name there. We have the two Ethernet ports that you use to plug it into your LAN uh, to interconnect to your PBX or unified communication solution. Then we have some LEDs here, indicators. That's the power that you see lit there. It looks like there's an alarm. And uh, I'm suspecting, I'm just going to guess, I don't know offhand, uh, that that is for the PRI, that other indicator. Then we have some USBs. Um, moving around to the left side, there you got to take a look at the, uh, the rack mount ears. They are not machined. They're, they're just uh, sheet metal, which is not a problem. Just take a note there. And here, a vent on this side, and on the right side, you have the fans, and you can probably hear them there, I'm suspecting. There's four of them. To, it looks like it's blowing the air out on this side, so pulling it in on the other side, I suspect. Okay, and we move around to the back, and we see the PRI, single PRI ja uh, port, and also the other expansion ports. And I've been, I, real, I understand that this unit needs to go back to net, or a certified partner, to upgrade it. And you can add FXO, FXS ports in there, and uh, I'm not sure what the the uh, capacity as far as PRIs, but I'm sure it's more than one. That's just a guess. Right over here, we are seeing the power. It's a it's not it does not redundant power capable. I don't believe so. Um, or this one is not configured that way, but I don't think it's I think only one power cable, and it's a regular um, AC power cord with no keeper. There's not a keeper to make sure it gets on, doesn't get unplugged. It's just a regular plugger in. Over here we have a little uh, ground. And that is the UX1000. This is a uh, NET's entry level unit. They have also the UX2000. And uh, there you have it.